What is up guys, Pro Player Apathy back in the building with another Infinite Warfare video for you guys today. Trying to get back on the grizzly, trying to get back on the grind. You know me, I've been playing a lot of Infinite Warfare, but I haven't really been posting YouTube videos. And today I'm going to be playing and showing you guys... Great, I get double teamed. I am playing 2v3. I try to join plenty of games and for some reason it's either 2v3, 3v4 because you can easily lead the game. Uh, there's no penalty in this, there's no, there's nothing. So it's just been happening. Hey, I see you pal. Oh, team just helped me. Uh, there's a guy, there's there's a windows here. I see one right there. He's coming here. There's one head glitching. Damn, I couldn't get him. All right, now we have a 4v4. There's something called a competitive playlist. And the thing is about this, you can choose the game type you want to play. So I decided to hop on some hard point because I feel like arena you know, or a competitive playlist, like watch, watching S&D, uplink, all these game types. It's not entirely fun to watch at times or fun to play. I think the most fun is definitely Hardpoint. So that's why I decided to put on Hardpoint and play some of this and really try it out. Give it a little bit of a test run. Um, so far, I've been really enjoying this game. I think there's some things they need to work on, some kinks, like... Oh, two-piece. Some little kinks and, like, and you know, TTKs. And it's kind of too fast sometimes. Gunton. And there is a little things that needs to work on. I'm not gonna sit here and bullshit and, bull and lie. And I really hope they fix these things within the next uh, couple days or so because it'd be really disappointing if they don't. Like I'd be, I will be really upset. And I've been upset, man. Have you guys seen the friend list? There's no, there's not a recent players. There's no such thing. As, oh my God, good help. There's no such thing as recent players. And there's no such thing. Like I press triangle to view my friends list. I can't even view my friends list. Like my thing is just broken. Like, there's so many things wrong with this game, and it's just, it's been pissing me off, it's been stressing me out, and I'm not in the happiest mood about it. Okay, boy, it's pretty good. But I am using the E-Rad, if you guys noticed. Uh, E-Rad is probably, in my opinion, a top two sub. I think it's the, e in my opinion, the Evo and the E-Rad are the two best subs right now. And that's, and that's a really good opinion, trust me. I've been playing the game a lot, like I said. I've been watching a lot of gameplay as well. I've been watching other people play. I've played against pros, I've played eight. And for the most part, people are using E-Rads and Evos here and there as well. But I think E-Rads takes the cake. I feel like energy weapons are just so much better in general. Because if you guys have tried the Volk, which you should try if you haven't. It's basically a Man of War on steroids. It's, it's, a, man, it's a Man of War, but a little bit better. It, it, it kills you in three bullets. It has, absolutely melts you and destroys you. Oh, I wanted a glitch there. And it's literally insane. So if you haven't tried the Volk, I would really recommend you try it. If you ever play search turn, if you've played search tourneys or play anything recently, it's just straight up like three to four volks every game. There's at least there's at least a team using three volks at least. Oh, glitch out, baited, sucker. And also, you guys might be questioning, what is that boost I'm doing? It looks like the AW dash. This boost right here. Well, it's in, it's it's for it's in the synaptic rig. It's in the synaptic rig. It basically allows you to do a little boost like this. And it kind of gives you that little small AW dash. And it's kind of op I really hope in competitive they take it out. If they don't take it off, I just hope they... I just... I don't know. I, I, it needs to go, man. It's, it's so unfair. You know, one person obviously will have it. Because, you know, in competitive, one person per rig. But I just find it pretty cheap, really cheap, really unfair. Like, I'd rather just not play with it at all. It just makes the movement a lot more crazy. And, like, if you're playing against a guy, like, let's say I'll probably be using it on my team. But, like... My whole team is going to be bitching about their their guy, their player doing it. You get it, and then what makes it worse, you get it like every five seconds. Can't wall bank this, bitch. You get it like every five seconds, so. Oh, I got a two-piece. I was going to get three. So, therefore, it makes it pretty op but I just really hope to take it out. Uh, I've been really enjoying the game. I've been really having a ton of fun. This is this better be like a test run though. This playlist is cool. I like the whole idea that you get to be able to you get to choose and pick exactly what you want to play. I think that's pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie. Like I, I like the idea, but there's no penalty if you leave. You know, it's not really really. Oh, let's go. This gun is so good. There's no really a. a it's not really a playlist like it's not some sort of ranked playlist it's basically you know like a pub match that's all it really is which is like i said i don't mind the idea i like it. it's not it's not it's not the worst you know there's been a worse but i just feel like they could do better I, I really hope within i hope they bring like some sort of playlist like in black ops 2 black ops 3 had something that was pretty all right uh i think definitely black ops 2 was the best so far so i hope they put in something like that i think that would be actually really sick let's see you got that Shrieks in this game aren't that good in my opinion. Um, they could, they have a lot of work to do. Not the E-Rad though. I feel like a lot of you guys are going to ask me the question like, Apti, what are you rocking on your E-Rad? 
Oh, that crack is sick. I did not know you could do that. I did not know where I'm going. I'm sorry. I haven't played this map as much. So basically what I have in my E-Red right now is I have Long Barrel, which is not called Long Barrel. It's called like Particle Amp, uh, amp or something. Some Something along those lines. I don't even remember the exact name. I have Quick Draw, Grip, and Stock. That's all I have. I have four attachments. I make it sound like it's a little bit. I'm like, that's all I have. Uh, I do have four attachments. Damn it, dude. I'm currently cooking right now. Oh, I like the idea that they put a little respawn timer as well, but the spawns and hard points still are still kind of messed up. Like they make sort of sense, but then at times they don't make sense, and they need they need work. They like they definitely need work. So I hope I hope within you know, like I said, I hope like very soon. Like they know they they know there's stuff wrong. Okay, with the game, with the system, everything. They're, they know there's stuff wrong. Like there's without a without a doubt. Like they know there's stuff wrong. People are complaining. Pro players are complaining. So I really hope you know they listen to us. They've been listening to us so far. I really hope they listen to us and be like, all right, let's let's uh, fix this. Let's fix this. And I hope they don't take their time with it. Gunson. Okay, I didn't really gun that guy. I just felt like saying Gunson though. I really hope they don't take their time with it. And be like, all right, let's go. Let's get to work. You know. I mean, I know I know they they probably haven't had much of a break. You know, because obviously they've been making the game this whole time. But I just really hope, like I really really hope they you know fix the friends list situation. Damn it, dude! I didn't expect to like get an angle. I got, I gotta learn more. The French friends list situation. Uh, put a recent players in. You know, fix the spawns up a little bit. Like they're not the worst, but they're just so random at times, which literally doesn't make any sense. So I hope they fix that. Rewind, bitch. I love rewind. It's so weird. Oh, he has a dope. So, and I hope they they really you know try to fix the game up because in this game, in my opinion, like it's fun. It has potential. It has potential to be great. Like it's not that bad of a game. It really isn't. But there's just stuff that needs to be fixed, and it's the only way it's going to make the game a lot more fun and a lot more competitive, in my opinion. But so far, I've been enjoying it. I've been grinding. A little bit stressful at times. Like I say, when I play Search and Destroy, I'm playing against four people who has this AW dash and are using four... He glitched? Oh, he glitched. 100%. He, he glitched backwards. He's like, wait, where am I? Who has this dash? So you see how easy it is and how good it is? And then have four, like three to four volts. It's just so annoying. You just instantly get killed. You know, you if you peek around a corner for at least a second, like you can't show their peek. Like the Volk will will incinerate you. Turn on you, turn on you. Come on, where are you at? Oh, you challenged me smartly. You did not you did not just brainlessly challenge me. I'll give you that much. But I hope they put in like a ranked playlist and some whatnot. These kids, what I what I also like about this playlist is like no one is gonna accidentally go into the arena play like to the competitive playlist. They're gonna be like, oh let me see, what is this? Like I feel like what? Another thing, beating down is so shit in this game. Like, you can one punch, you can still use the technique I do, but like, sometimes you don't get auto aim, sometimes you just don't get any pull. Like, you just saw me beat down literally behind them. I literally just made a hit from the back. I didn't get a hit marker. It, it, it just didn't register Some something weird, really weird. Uh, so, I don't know what that's all about. I feel like they need to fix that. A little, add a little bit extra auto aim to the beat down or some shit, or actually add a little bit of a lunge. Is the, like it's bad enough the beat down is is not a one shot kill like it's not a one shot kill right so I had at least a little bit of a lunge don't just make it like oh you have to be straight up on it like the lunge is almost non-existent I try I've tried doing the one punch so many times like it works it, it registers sometimes it works but there's times where it just doesn't three piece give me that baby still trying to learn this map uh oh oh bitch bitch that rhymes I'm sorry. And now I'm just getting assists. That's all I'm getting, man. It's actually kind of, kind of sickening if I may add myself. So yeah, they need to fix those things. But uh, man, it's fun. The game is fun. It just it needs work. And I feel like what also kills the game a little bit is the maps. Oh my god, this map called Mayday that I'm sure a lot of you guys have played it already. Probably one of the worst search maps ever played. And apparently, like people played a hard point SD like. I feel like it's it's not as bad, but it's probably still really bad. But I just feel like, oh my god, I'm so good. Psych, I suck, guys. I just feel like hard point. I feel like SD May Day is just a tr it's so freaking bad. Like I just like it pisses me off. Even Crusher, Crusher's not too bad, but it's also like the lane, the maps are just really bad in my opinion. There's only a couple good maps. Uh, Retaliation, if you guys played it, it's kind of like the NW3 map and uh, Retaliation. Oh, that kid almost got gunned. Hey, pick up the gun. Oh, I'm still not dead. Oh, and I got double team. Uh, retaliation, throwback. Uh, there's only like three maps that are good, in my opinion. Two to three maps. 
And uh, like majority maps are pretty bad, so I, that kind of sucks. But it is what it is. Come on, challenge man. I know you want to. I know you want to. Oh, how did I not kill him? You know, one of my goals got to be get a hundred kills in competitive playlist, arena playlist, arena playlist. What do you want to call it? I feel like I could do it. I'm almost at sixty. It's it's gonna be really difficult. I'm gonna need like a map like throwback probably where it's really close engagements. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Just like a live comp talking about the game a little bit. Haven't really talked much about it at all. And, you know, just showing you guys a little preview of the game, the, the playlist. What, what I was saying before I cut myself off was I really like the idea of a competitive hardpoint or a competitive playlist because it's so hard for someone to just kind of go in there. You know, someone has to, like, kind of have a sense of competitiveness and, like, oh, like, I think I'm a good player. Let me try this kind of kind of mentality mentality. So when you play this playlist, you're usually going to play against kids who are pretty good or really good. Like, usually when you play Arena and Black Ops 3, like, you run across, like, people who are shit and don't even know how to play the game. I feel like that's going to be a lot different on this game. So that should be good, and it's a little bit more of a challenge, a little bit more fun. So I hope you guys are interested in this video. Like I said, if you like, comment, subscribe. I'm out. This is your boy, Peace out. Hope you have a great day.